we are going to look into the continuous non-level benefit insurance. When we are saying it is a continuous insurance, it means that the benefit will be paid at the moment the policyholders die. When we are saying it is non-level benefit, it means that the level of the benefit will keep on changing with time. There are so many ways that the benefit can be made. It will be different from cases to cases. But we are only going to look into the most two common cases which are continuously increasing whole life insurance and annually increasing whole life insurance. Let's look at the first case, continuously increasing whole life insurance. It means that the benefit will keep on increasing with time. So the benefit functions would be PTX equals to TX. And the present value of the random variable would be discounting the TX, which is PTX times with TX. Expected value of the random variable would be integrations from 0 up until infinity because we are looking at the whole life insurance VT TPX mu x plus T DT this is representing the probability of dying and this one is the discount factor since we have this value of TX for the present value of the random variable we are going to have T here because it will keep on increasing with time. It has a special actual notation which is I bar A bar X. X is the age of the entrance into the policy and there is a bar above A. It means that the payment will be made at the moment of death and the bar above I means that the amount of the benefit will keep on changing with time. Okay, now let's look at the second case. Second case is about the increasing annually. Increasing annually means that, let's say you have time 0, 1, 2, and so on, up until infinity. So the first year, payment would be, let's say, $1. If die within the second year, you will receive $2. Die within the third year, you will receive $3 and so on and so on. But the amount of the payment will be paid at the moment of death. If you die somewhere in the middle here, you will receive the payment in the middle here. Okay, let's look at the benefit function. Benefit functions for this case will be tx plus 1 with a flaw and then the present value when the variable would be tx plus 1 with flaw times with v tx expected value let's assume this one is also z equals to Integrations from 0 to infinity. T plus 1. Vt. Tpx. Mu x plus t. Dt. It also has a special actual notation which is. I. A. X. Bar. You can see the bar is only above A. There is no bar above I. Because. The continuous case is only for the time that the payment will be made. That, that means that when you see there is above A, there is a bar, the payment from the insurance company will be made at the moment of death. That's it for this video. Thank you.